So the reason I, for the breakup is not my concern. Okay. My concern is now I have you, okay. you have me. Okay. Then it is the two of us. Plus. Just the and two of us. Just the two of us. So in as much because you can be used as a DV plate. <laughs> you have to talk for form. You just use that one. Near the anonym crew and go for him say you talk careful for. But tomorrow, when you register the car well, yeah, why what to feed? So you might just be a DV plate. You're the one chest street. <laughs> so just play the game, but then I will love the person, yeah. then I will let the person know. You see, you can't give lady rules. Oh. Okay. Ladies, you, can't give them you want to give them rules. You will turn following the rules. <laughs>
uh, I'm going to use me. Yourself. Yeah. It's, it's actually happened to me. <laughs> so you <laughs> know, you know, slide, listen. <laughs> actually happened to me. Is okay? <laughs> let, let, let me list you well. <laughs> the, the very first girl that I dated, okay, she used to date my best friend. Okay. But then my best friend left the school. So she didn't have anyone other than us to be with because okay. he was like far away, okay. very far away. And then, and then, and then, and then she ended up with me. But things didn't really work out, and she went to someone that I really knew. Okay. I usually used to work with that person for a lot. I won't classify the person as my best friend, okay. but I used to work with that person a lot. Now with this situation. She's not with me anymore, but okay. she's with the guy that I really know. Yeah. Sure. Why will I ever have an intention to just automatically turn the person into someone I don't like because now he's dating my ex? Okay. It doesn't make sense. Okay. okay. Just to turn on him just like that. It, it might be that maybe you would feel a bit jealous because sometimes you would want to get back to the girl. Okay. It is sometimes when I understand. men, men sometimes when you break up with girls, or maybe when a girl breaks up with us, you know, for the very first um, time, the guy will be like, oh, I don't care, I don't care. But maybe the girl will be there somewhere thinking about it, sure. if they, the two of them are really close to each other. But at some point, the girl will start forgetting, and we, the men, will start like, I used to be like this with this girl. Yeah. I used to be like that with this girl. Now, when he sees this uh, girl with another person, he would have all those memories back, and he might feel like slight jealousy. Sure. If he actually had a thing with the girl, mm -hmm. he might feel slight jealousy. But in this case, it doesn't necessarily mean you should attack the new person that is with her. Okay. It, it would just be very bad on your side because mm -hmm. just move on. Okay. There are so many girls out there to yeah. <laughs> <It's fine. laughs> So Ram has emphasized that it shouldn't necessarily mean that the ex should be your enemy. You might not be friends, but he or she should be your enemy. So we are guys. So we would look at he not being our enemy. Of course. Beautiful. Let me come to you, Sly. Because I have a question to ask Ram, but let me come to you. <laughs> well, <laughs> Kofi, I was just listening to my brother here. Yeah. Fine. The first thing is not your enemy. Mm -hmm. Okay. But me? No. I'll give you some level. Okay. You will not be my enemy as you're saying. I agree to that. But you will not also be my friend. Okay. Yes. You're not my enemy. <laughs> You're not my friend. friend. Okay. Yes, because this, we are talking about the matters of the heart. Yes. Ah, are you Charlie? The person, you really loved the person, right? And quite unfortunate. It might even happen that it was just a slight mistake. And then one of them couldn't wait and maybe bump into another relationship. So me, I think that me being like a tight friend with that person will bring another opportunity of getting closer to my woman. You know, sure. and no, 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 no. It, wow. it shouldn't be that. I like we can be cool, but then you are not a friend uh, so, that you can you can come to my house. Uh, no, no, no. Okay, beautiful. Coming to my question, I want to ask. I read a story um, on socials. Okay. So this guy dated a lady, and their breakup wasn't something that um, the lady was in agreement with. So the lady was like. I don't want to leave you. Sure. So the guy left the lady, married a different lady. Okay. But they were doing like, you are my side chick. But the guy realized at a point that mm -hmm. the ex not anymore as a side chick you know, is growing. So he felt you also need to get your own family. Sure. So let's stop whatever we are doing and go get a man for yourself. Then the girl said, still, it's you I want. Even if I will go, impregnate me and give me a child before I allow you to go. And the guy said, I want. Then he said, if you are not, I'm going to make sure I destroy your marriage by getting closer to your wife. And truly, truly, 
she got closer to the wife and she became the best friend of the wife. Now the guy cannot open up and tell the wife that, oh, this lady you brought or introduced to me as your best friend. It's my ex. And this is her intention. So the guy has kept quiet, but feels insecure that now my ex is closer to my wife. My wife feels she's the best friend. Sure. So my question now is, Ram, you are saying the guy is not your friend. So let's make, let's get an instance that when you met the lady you are with currently, she told you that, oh, this is what the guy did. The guy cheated on me. The guy was not treating me well. The guy was this, 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 this. Then, you still see this guy and feel like you are comfortable with this guy coming around your home and say, hey, hello, hi. Oh, oh, Charlie, what's up? What's happening, Charlie? I hope you are cool. And like, Ram, what's your take on this? Okay. <laughs> so, if I'm supposed to get what you are saying, the girl has broken up with the guy. Yeah. And the girl has told you everything that happened. Of course, how, they break up and everything. But then the guy comes around here and is still some kind of way. There's a weird yeah, vibe. Yeah, yeah. You see, in this kind of situation, you haven't seen anything yet. Yeah. Okay. You haven't seen them do anything yet. Yeah. You are only suspecting that yeah. there's something odd because both of them are still doing this while they're yeah. Why do you want to see first? No, 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 no. Listen, 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 listen. Let, let me, let me, let me laugh. Let me laugh. <laughs> Sorry, let me laugh. Okay. okay. So, at this point, you see, when you are entering a relationship, okay. one of the very uh, solid things in relationships are trust. It's sure. trust. Sure. Okay. You trust your partner. You don't expect them to do something that would uh, impede your relationship that you have. It will destroy everything. Sure. So then, when something like this is happening, you don't go to the guy and uh, face him that you are doing this to my woman, you are doing that to my woman, whilst you've not seen it yet. The only thing you can do at that moment is keep a close eye on what is going on. And when something is so obvious that happens, that's when you can hit on that point that, I saw you doing this with uh, this guy, yet you are saying that, you are not with him anymore. So explain to me why you are you are doing this and I have seen this. Okay. When something like that is there, you, you can actually stand on a point and, mm -hmm. and talk. Okay. Because uh, when someone asks you about it, you can have like something to stand on. But at the moment you haven't seen anything. All all you have is like uh suspicions. Like, okay. It won't land you something very solid. Of course. Okay. So to me, I would just like pay very close attention and I'll try as much as possible to trust my partner okay because what if what if what if uh, I am seeing this okay. and then I don't think I don't I don't become rational and I just act on my emotions okay in the very end if actually nothing was really really going on you will end up losing your relationship because of that. Of because course. your lash out will make your uh, partner very well. Like the person I'm, I'm with is he okay. Like, yeah. can I be with this person in the future? If something similar happens, can I be with this person? Sure. No, you are, we are all human beings. We will try as much as possible to stay away from people that will harm us. Okay. So when you just lash out, it is going to be very bad to. Whoever that is around you, and especially your relationship in this matter, so I don't think you should just act. Okay, um, Sly, <laughs> the way you're looking at me, <laughs> let's talk. Me, yeah, I, for one thing, he said this, um, and I also go with it is the trust. Since we all know relationship is something I deals with trust. Trust, yeah. But, Kofi, me, me. <laughs> <laughs> like I don't even want to hear the name X. X. What, what is the X for? Because people have the notion that X means something that has expired. <laughs> so if you are my partner's X, you shouldn't be around. around. Like yes, because some people even have their excess contacts on their phone. They chat on WhatsApp. They check up on you. Like Kofi, <laughs> the person is your ex, yeah. and you are chatting morning to ask. What a person is doing. Afternoon, have you eaten? Yeah. Evening, have you eaten? Are you sleeping? I need someone to talk to 
and I wanted to just check. Master, you want this? Why, why did you left? Okay. That is my first point. Okay. You want this? In the first place, we she, this one, let me see, even say it in three. Okay. Baby, are you so jano? A one you do jano. Sure. But sometimes you do no as you and you do and no, no, a son term change said you will start to saw you. Yes, because a jano is the sea and you can't so jano. I'm a anony in answer. And you see, you go so. I say no, do a castle so on from market to be bo. So, me, I will not even trade my relationship on that way, that angle. No, I won't do that. Because what I believe is that the more the person gets close, then the vibe starts to what? Go up again. I'm not saying that, I, yes, I also go with what you are saying. I will not just wake up, go there, and then start talking. No, but in as much as the person has left their relationship and now with me, it should be me. You, you, you. Yes, because I see people saying that, oh, he's my bestie. What can that person best that I can't even best more? <laughs> he can't best anything more than what me you? because you chose me. Yes. And I, you, you knew that I can best more than the, what the person is bestie. <laughs> so, uh, so in that case, what I would say is, my take on this is that since the person has now choosing me as the person he wants to move with, then I have to devise a strategy of keeping the person. Okay. Because in as much as I'm giving you the freedom to do whatever you want, I have to also be careful about the fact that that your ex being your close friend gives the person the free passport to my house, free visa to my house. And Obihuna or Tony Pro Matam Fueni. Eh? And I'll come from where well, my friend see you see this time around. What happened is the guy who have your contact, you also have the guy's contact. So it will be like you you at work. Oh Charlie, I want to come to the house. So like I, I see you keep. I want to come and check up. Then he will come. The first day he will come, the second day, then it will become a, like a constant thing every day, a normal thing he's coming. I will be at work. I'm not saying that I don't trust my partner, but my brother. There's something you don't have to even try it. So, Ebiani or Pepe, no. Ya di besi we numi emfro okra na. Me F F Tchum. What you say? And Ebiani is where the bida o. Until we know who we said. So it's like me. I would take it like you being. You have not dated before. Then you go into relationship. Then the first person treats you well. You. It's like that person has become your savior because he has exposed something to you. And at that moment, you see what people are doing, saying you see you. So if you're even doing it, you feel like it's normal thing. So me, no, be maintaining that cool friendship, asking morning, afternoon, evening. Yeah, it will be something else. Yes. I agree with the part where he said, uh, he says, uh, maybe you give opportunity for your ex to come to your house and to become no more thing. Yes, I still stand on what I'm saying. But what I'm going to say to his is, yes, you don't agree to that. Of course. You set limitations mm -hmm. to uh, let the person know where exactly they stand now. Yes. Initially, you were my uh, something, you were yeah. my partner. Mm -hmm. But now, you are not anymore based on some certain things. So, Things like, at first I could allow you to come to my home just like that and come and eat and come and have fun. Now, you don't have that um, free, this one anymore. So, you set limitations. I'm not saying you don't set limitations. Yes. You set limitations. But when you don't do that and the person keeps coming to... You see, you're at work. You wouldn't know what is going on at home. Okay. So, you have the full right to question your uh, partner. Yes. Why exactly are you letting this person come to this place when you are telling me the person is not anymore with you? So yes, you set limitations. I'm not saying you don't set limitations. Yes. That's that's all I want to add to that. I'm mm -hmm. not saying you don't set Okay. So coming back to what we are talking about, I want to ask this. Don't you think the basis for the breakup also set the tone for how you treat your partner's ex? Because for instance, myself, 
I remember I had an instance. So in Takadi, I was with my my wife now, then my so my partner still. So we were walking through town, and she had already told me about the ex or something like that. So I already had that furious like Muna many of you. We we just get down from the car, market circle. They see this person, then go close and they hug, and they stand there and talk for like five minutes. And I'm like, Daddy, I went crazy. I was like, like why? Am I know like at that stage, no me na market circle, me with them, and I'm like, I was totally angry to the point. So I feel like sometimes you know, the reason for their breakup can also get you, the current person that you are dating, to feel something about the ex. I don't know what you think. So, for example, if Ram, your ex, goes on and dates a new guy and tells the new guy that, oh, Ram treated me very nice, Ram was good, Ram never did anything wrong, I felt at a point that distance is not helping us. If you tell me that I feel like, oh, this guy is a nice guy, Yes, there's a probability now you being close, something can happen. Of course. Of course. Of course. So, I would have to be very cautious about how the two of you communicate. But I'm not angry with you. Yes. Um, then there's another point that my your ex can come to me now, dating me and tell me that Ram cheated on me. Anytime I complain, she beat, uh, he beats me up and stuff like that. Automatically, within me, I have that notion of you that this boy is not a good guy. Okay. automatically. Yes. Yes. But I'm just angry with you for treating somebody's daughter that way. Yes. So sometimes I feel like the way the relationship also ends mm -hmm. gives the room for either you seeing the person as an enemy okay. or a friend. Mm -hmm. That notwithstanding, how would you treat your partner's ex. Now that we know that Ram is saying um, the guy is not your enemy, mm -hmm. now the guy is closer. You mm -hmm. live in the same, like you said, your friend mm -hmm. is in the same neighborhood, you are back and everything. How would you treat, how would you make sure that there is constant um, line drawn mm -hmm. that nobody breaks? You, your wife, your partner respects that you don't like this, though the person is your friend, but they can't keep contact and be chatting. How do you maintain? How do you make sure that happens? Now, because you are saying, oh, to me, what time for he, he cannot be your friend. How do you maintain that? Okay, so the first thing is because, like you said, distance yeah. caused the breakup, and now the person is around, so there's a high probability that they might end up talking to each, each other. You see, eh? <laughs> <laughs> this is very funny. Yeah. At this point, at this point, you see, every guy, every guy, when a guy wants to date a girl mm. that he likes, he tries as much as possible to impress her. Yeah. Okay. Do something <laughs> that, you, he will do something that uh, maybe he thinks no other person has done Damn. that has drawn this girl attention before yeah. even though if you've done it crap like you try to do it like better better and now here's a situation where the ex that had a long distance has come around and is around this one yeah. at this point to me to me <laughs> to run <laughs> <laughs> you've you've stayed with this girl yeah you've done everything with her yeah. you know the situation at hand yeah. You've talked to her about how she should do things, how she should not go close to him so much that it will make you feel disturbed or jealous. But after all this talk, and then you, you end up seeing that she's doing exactly the opposite of what you told her not to be doing, like talking to the guy, now he's close, making fun, touching yeah, each other. Yeah. Here, I don't think you, the guy, you are at fault. And I also don't think the guy who the has come guy. Yes, the ex is at fault the person who is at fault is the girl because you've you've set boundaries for her yeah. that you broke up with this person and you are with me now yeah. okay you are with me now you stay there your reason that doesn't mean that now the person has come no you are leaving me you are going to that person then why why in the first place why do you come and date me 
just stay there and wait for the person to come around and do the business. But then it, it will look like you are using me as some kind of like side stance yeah. for the guy to come back. Mm. Then you will no, no. I will never no, accept no, this. Thing. I will very, very not accept this. Right. So to me, I don't see any any problem with me trying to. You should know. You should know. Okay, you should know that definitely if it were to be the girl, if it were to be the girl, let's reverse the situation. If it were to be the girl and I'm a guy and then I had a relationship with another girl somewhere and then she wasn't around though. So we couldn't like really make the make relationship work. really work. work. And then now the girl has come around. Obviously because we've had so um like a long time apart we will like try to catch up and stuff like that. I am telling you, if the girl sees me talking more than even 10 minutes with the other girl, the way she go crazy. Yeah, 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 <laughs> yeah. another the, issue. The, the, even when you are done and she's talking to you, the, the, the attitude. attitude and I'm the, it, like, you are trying to even, at first, she won't like really tell you the, the problem. She'll yeah. be giving you attitude. Yeah. And when you are sometimes trying to uh, ask her for the reason why she's giving, you see, you see, honestly, honestly, it's a fact that girls are very, very um, emotionally intelligent than men. Okay. okay, so there are certain things we might think it is not a big deal, yeah, to but to a, to a girl, yeah. she'll see this thing like World Cup. Yeah. So you would try to be asking, oh, what did I do? What did yeah. I do? Or oh, best stress, so uh, ah. Yeah. And then she will finally tell you the whole thing. Like it will be very bad in, when it comes to girls. It'll be very bad. Okay. So in our situation, I also I won't. I won't allow that okay. because once the person has been away and you've come to me, stay with me. Okay. But if the person has come back and you are going to that person, person. it means the the whole reason why you came to me was uh, it was it was a fake reason. Yeah, just for some time, just yes. to, just to it, occupy it, space for someone. It's very bad to use me as like a rebound <laughs> guy. Kind. No, 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 no. Okay, so it's like coming yeah. to the same thing. My brother. That is why I stated earlier. <laughs> you will not be the friend. Okay. I don't care about your reason for breakup. Okay. You don't care. I don't care. And I, I don't. <laughs> it's I don't. Not a problem. Okay. person me humpo. Okay. My issue is Michelle. I've met you, and the agreement is simple. You said you are single, yeah. and you want to mingle with me. Yeah. Let's move as that. Your breakup, even if the, if the guy was buying you everything, yeah. if he bought you a car, uh, you don't care. I don't care. House, you don't care. <laughs> if it is your father or your mother that said don't date him, I don't okay. care. Okay. Me, I don't care about anything. No. <laughs> my, that is why I said there's nothing like X in my dictionary. Okay. No, 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 no. The person is gone. Is gone Go forever. You can talk to him. But that is the point we're also making. There shouldn't be any kind of closeness too tight. And then I'm saying, dear, no X. And then the thing, the, the, the thing is, the thing is, I'm going straight to the point. Uh, you, the issue for breakup is not my concern. Because how sure are you that the person you have met right now is telling you the, the actual right. reason for the breakup. Okay. So let's be sincere to ourselves. Because you go out right now, you have a girlfriend, yeah. and maybe the girl is too demanding, yeah. something like that. Then you go and meet another girl who is very good, <laughs> like taking care of you. Yeah. I don't know, you know the yeah. one that they're talking yeah. about. Yeah. Then you want to slide, then move to the, the yeah. new person. Yeah. Because you know, say, a then the yeah. person is not like giving you pressure, pressure to go and find a work to do and give you, the person was doing that. Then you go to this lady, <laughs> the lady that I'm dating, I'm with a lady right now, but the, the lady I'm dating, she's giving me pressure to go and find a work and do this, this, this and that. And you go and say this, this no, 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 for no, no, no. a reason for her to accept you. No, 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 no. You will find a good no, reason, no. a nice one, so that no, no. the same thing apply, like, applies yes. to the ladies. Sure. So in this case, she would tell you something that will attract you. Yeah. You said, ah, a nice lady like this, and she was doing this and that. 
and this guy beating her. Oh, no, no, no. I have to tweet her. I'm with my queen. Now I'm with my... Master. So the reason I, for the breakup... It's not my concern. Okay. My concern is, now I have you. Okay. You have me. Okay. Then it is the two of us. Just the and two of us. Just the two of us. So in as much... Because you can be used as a DV plate. <laughs> you have to talk for from... <laughs> You just use that one. Me the anonym crew man go for him say you talk half of for. But tomorrow when you register the car well, yeah, why what to feel? So you might just be a DV plate. Yeah, the whole chest street. <laughs> so just play the game. But then I will love the person. Yeah. Then I will let the person know. You see, you can't give lady rules. Okay. Ladies, you can't give them. You want to give them rules. You will turn following the rules. <laughs> you will set a target for them, and they will target you. <laughs> of course, I would like you will set a target for them, and the, the target will itself will be targeting you. So, as for me, for what I will say is, treat her well. Let her know that you love her. Yes, truly, you love her. And then you have to also go an extra mile. As you said, to put your eye on her. Not that you don't trust her. Okay. But one thing I know about love is, I would say is, um, it is not difficult for someone to go back to the ex. Yeah. It is just easy. Yeah. Because you might be doing everything for her. You can, you can do whatever you want. But see, the love that they share, for all you know, that person might even be the first love. Yeah. So the issue here is, the, their breakup is not an issue okay. because he can, the guy can even do anything to hurt her. But the love she had for the person can send her back. Okay. You, see, you are doing your best to keep her. Yeah. But in as much as you see her moving astray, just let her know that at least this is what is happening. And this this my take on the issue. I don't like this, I don't like that. But I don't think that setting a boundary for her can be anything. Okay. You, when you, you, you say, okay, fine, you said she, she shouldn't get close to the guy. She didn't charge the guy. She didn't charge the guy. Will 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 and you, will 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 can you, do you even have her, her password? <laughs> you don't have, even if you have it, can you see where you hide the chat? Yeah. You don't even know. Who delete chat every day? <laughs> ah, they, now, um, I think they have something like, Automatic yeah, delivery. Yeah, 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 yeah. hours. You, whilst you are sleeping, she's chatting. Yeah. And he, you wake up. You, even you, you are going to work. Yeah. And then the guy will come. She knows when you come back home. Yeah. And time, guys and that kind of behavior, they have clothes from work. I'm coming. If even they are doing anything, the guy will just leave and go. Yeah. So, media, coffee, wake up. What break here, pa? Okay. Your okay. issue okay. is not my issue. <laughs> now okay. you are starting a new thing. It, you have a new beginning. Yes. And let's let's move with that. Okay. Forget about your past. Wow. I'm, I'm your present. Wow. For, okay. Forget about your ex. Okay, then um, my last question. Then we all bring our submission finally. So now Ram is saying that um, his partner's ex is not his enemy. Yes, That's no problem with that. You are also saying that. Your partner's ex is not enemy, but he has nothing. He can never be a friend. You have nothing in common. Mm -hmm. Ram is saying that you can be cool, hello, hello, but he, he's not having problem with it. Now, let's look at it. We guys and ladies, so now it's our turn, so let's forget ladies. We guys, going back to our exes, what is the rate at which we move fast to our exes? <laughs> let's look at it. So... I'm now in a relationship with my current partner. <laughs> but I love my ex. Something happened, you, you bro broke up and everything. The rate mm -hmm. at which, if opportunity comes, mm -hmm. say, yeah, you need to strong, but you have a crano. What is the rate? Let's look at 1 to 10. Young guys, the rate at which you move sharp, no? how is it going to be like? <laughs> it's a very difficult Mm. The rate at which we will move to the ex. You know, to me, I would say it depends. Okay. Okay. Okay, so you are with your current girl. Yeah. <clears throat> and your ex, maybe what you share with your ex, you are not really getting that from your current girlfriend. Current girl. 
you feel like uh, there are certain things that she's not really giving you, okay? At that, at that, at that, at that moment, or with with that, uh, the rate at which you would start to think about going back to your ex, if your ex is like also like, mm, <laughs> like <laughs> okay, yeah, with yeah. you, it is very highly possible because yeah. she, she's also trying to win you back. Yeah. But she's not getting an opportunity. And sure. then something like this is happening with your current girlfriend. You're feeling like you're not getting what you want. Yeah. But you used to have that with your ex. ex. Remember, oh, yeah, because it's yeah. Yeah. get on the ground with Mumbo. <laughs> like, you would never <laughs> notice that like something like this is happening. Yeah. By the time you realize, you will start giving you shabby excuses yeah. that, oh, see, 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 then pa, you cut you off. But if, uh, for the other side, yeah. This is when um, maybe the first part is when uh, you're not really getting what you want. Yeah. But for the second part, where you're with your uh, current girlfriend, yeah. everything is going on cool for you, and then your ex is uh, also trying to cut in, or maybe your ex you want to move back to your ex. If if the guy feels very satisfied with what he has at the moment, I don't think there's there's a possibility, possibility for him of to go, go back, back to the ex. ex. Even even when the ex wants him so bad, you start to see the ex as a nuisance because leave me alone, move forward, I'm with this person, I'm okay. Okay. We we had a thing, but you, you weren't able to sustain me. Sure. And then we broke up. Now I'm with this person, you're trying to disturb me. He won't he won't listen to you. He'll wow. try to stay with the current one. Okay. So uh to me I'll say it depends. It depends. It depends. Sly. Nah. If he this side in there, here is where I will consider the reason for breakup. <laughs> yeah. Yes, yeah, okay. I will consider. <laughs> yes, Hannah, me take it your point. Okay. So here is where I will consider the reason for breakup. Sure. In the sense that, you see, sometimes eh, a relationship after your breakup, I don't call it most relationship. Okay. If you are getting me right, a relationship, a, just a relationship after, just after your breakup, those ones, for we got the makeup. We got the makeup. Yeah. Oh, okay. Okay. Yes. Here, it is not like you want to date. Too. Okay. Come at the see you know. Will be a bit pimp. So the reason for me saying that I will consider, uh the main cause of the breakup here is that maybe it was my fault okay. in fact i really love the person the person also loves me and we know say the future we have a bright future sure. so here i will consider the reason for our breakup and another side is that maybe as i said i wanted to make up for the mess i've created and a commonality, and someone is trying to put things together for me. So that one man, not necessarily being that I'm in a relationship, okay. I'm just there waiting for right. the right time for this person to return. Okay. I hope you get it. Sure. See, I'm saying this because not all people in a relationship are ready to be in that relationship. Okay. When you pick like 70%, you get life. 30% being in the relationship, not because they are in the relationship, they want to be there, but it's like what they have gone through. Now they say, say oh, anything can just go on. I hope you get it. Those people are just a substitute. And you say, oh, don't know. And you know, the the main main um, reason if it wasn't that that actual um, real love that the person is moving on, yeah. then the percentage of getting to the ex is very high okay. because you everything was working and I made a small mistake, a slight mistake, and then you left, and now the reason has been sorted out. Yeah. You, you are forgiving me and you are coming back. I'm with someone, but the reason is I'm not with the person because I love the person. I'm just there because I feel like I have, I, I want to move on. I said, oh, yes, she be so be moving on. So when the person comes, guys, dear, fast. We'll see what? We go back. Okay, so now um, our final submission on this slide. <clears throat> would your ex 
or would your partner's ex? Or what position would you put your partner's ex? Position? Yeah. A friend, acquaintance, or enemy? Which, this three, choose one. The other time, somebody was saying acquaintance means somebody I know. He's not my friend, he's not my enemy, but I just know the person. Okay. Then you have someone, oh, it's somebody on your machine. Okay. So this my madam for. Hello, hello. So we can move, have okay. new friends. And someone will say, what dating girl no? And your mom, one in a year, we won't me here, madam for. So you, where would you position the partner's ex? I'm positioning that person between acquaintance and then friends. So you'll be a semi-friend. Okay. Yeah. You are not my enemy. Okay. Yes, you are not my enemy. But you are far from my house. Okay. <laughs> okay. Of course, yes. You are not my enemy. But you are far from my house. Very far. Okay. So I'll give you that. You see, if you try to prevent your partner yeah. from going there, that one, you are making a mistake. She will even go. Okay. She will find a way to go. Oh. For my lady, my woman, I'll give you that right, that freedom. You can talk to the person, okay. but you know, we will have our own discussion, so you will know the rate at which you can talk to the person. Awesome. When I realize that that thing is going on, yeah. more than as we discussed, as my brother said, I'll do my small checking. You see that thing, boys, yeah. we know that vibe. Right. Uh -huh. I'll do that. When I do that, and I realize that no, you still have interest. Yes. I won't tell you anything. Yes. I will just back get my things ready because I know that regardless, yeah. you will leave. So yes. you can have that normal vibe. Right. Oh, good morning. How are you doing? But uh, the way you will talk to the person on phone for hours, one hour, and I'm there with you, chatting him in the morning, afternoon, evening, no. Uh, maybe once in a month, once in a week, it's fine. You can check up on the person. I don't have a problem. Yeah. But I have to know whatever yeah. that is happening. Yeah. And if you don't want me to know, I'll know it on my own way. you find your own way. I find my own way and know it. And then when I know it, I see it is not going to be. Then, Chris, Sarah, Sarah, we okay. move on. Now, when we come to Ram, then we wrap up the conversation. Ram, where would you position your partner's ex now? And what are the... So... You have the friend, you have the acquaintance, then you have the enemy. Where would you, from your heart, where would you position your partner's ex? Acquaintance. Acquaintance. So, I know you. Okay. You dated her. Okay. Okay. You yeah, did. Yeah. Okay. But if you find a situation like where I keep meeting you often and our relationship like somehow upgrades. Okay. Yeah, obviously we will try yeah, cool. to be friends. friends. We'll be cool, okay. guys. For guys, we we don't really hold grudges between. We've dated my, but okay. when you do something that is against okay. what I'm holding at the moment, we will attack you. Okay. For a guy, when you try to harm his um, I don't know, his pride or something that is uh, valuable to him, okay. he doesn't care. If you are his best friend, he can even like attack you. Sure. So, at the moment, you be my acquaintance. acquaintance. But per situation, you can be my friend. But to hold you as an enemy, mm -hmm. then it means you have done something that is against yes. me. Okay, yes. okay. Then so, you will be my enemy. So, I'm trying to get you. The person can only be your enemy. When, as you are with a girl, yes. he goes against certain things that against you feel it's not comfortable. It's that is when you would develop or you have that notion that this guy I will have a grudge with him. Okay, okay. But, but if he doesn't go there, there we are cool. cool. We are very cool. So wow. So the simplicity has been defined by we guys. Um our partner's ex is not our enemy. Since we all know our boundaries, I see you the ex, you know your boundary, you are an ex. You dated my partner. I don't have any problem with you. We can be acquaintance. I know like you see me. Oh, hello, yeah, hello. Or if situations come that we get to meet often and work, or instances come about like that, we can be friends. Oh, hello, yeah, Kwame, what's up? Oh, let me check you up. Okay, you wish your basketball court, no problem. But if me say, oh, trespassing, 
Oh, but I never join my friend. I love this conversation and I love how we all think alike as guys because anyway, can guys I should have the whole chest massa. Yeah, can you say can you can yeah we move on mm. and everybody goes his way. So thank you so much for coming. I think today we delayed, we went, but we will have a second version of this whereby each guy will have a lady here, oh. then we have the fights after the ladies' version. Then we are going yes, to contemplate and see. So thank you so much for passing through Ram and your first time passing through. We are going to bring you here again. So just get ready, you plan a better time, you come again for another topic. And slide this a second time. Thank you so much. But before you go, I want you to drop your social media handles how people can get interactive with you if they want to follow you or any way you want people to get interactive with you. If you're not comfortable, to just drop your name and we sign out. So, slide. Okay. So, as you know already, everywhere is like K. Okay. Any of the social media handles, you just, I mean, type like K and you will see me there. Okay. I'm very friendly open and welcome to any idea so you can just hit me up there okay. then okay. we take it up from there okay so that's why you say challenge in the part and the accident but we are about exit it's like <laughs> 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 okay so maybe how to wake up here about okay show follow us on all our social media platforms that is on facebook instagram so that is all coffee jc tv and all our platforms make sure you get interactive drop your comments we don't care whatever you think if you your partner's ex will still be your friend. We don't have a problem. So Ram is going to drop the social media handle and also drop. Okay, so they're going to drop your contacts for them to look at it. So you look inside the main camera, the middle one. This is yours. Then you drop your social media handle and uh, the contacts for them to get interactive with you. Okay. Okay. So uh, that's what's up. What's okay. Zero five four five four four three one one six. Okay. Again. So zero five four. Five four four three one six. Okay, so five four five four four three one six. Okay, so three get in one one six. Three one one six. Okay, so get interactive. You see the number on the screen. If you want to get interactive with Ram, um, Ram, Ram is saying that Charlie only the um, the partner and the ex the acquaintance. <laughs> he has no problem with the person. So thank you so much for watching this conversation. I want you to drop your comments. We want to know the position your partner's ex holds in your life. Is the person your friend? Is the person your acquaintance? Or the person is your enemy? Just drop it and let's know. The second version will be the ladies' version. Then after that, we bring one guy and a lady. Then we look at this topic. So Ram is going to get a guy, a lady here. They look inside their eyes and tell us deeply <laughs> what they really think about the yeah, past we're waiting, we're waiting for that time. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so thank you so much for watching this conversation. We are out.